one more time. That first one was a test run. Welcome everybody. It's AJ Namaste. Oh my goodness, it's been a while. Give me a couple seconds to adjust to this. Whoo. I didn't know. At first I wanted to do a full yoga class. That was my thought when I first got up. AJ Namaste woke up. I thought, let's do live yoga. But then I started reading all the Facebook posts. And I'm going to keep it real. I don't think it's right with me doing yoga when people don't got electricity. I don't think it's right for me. I live in this. I'm blessed. I rent a room. I'm not going to I'm not gonna lie. The world needs to know. I rent rooms because I couldn't afford rent. Rent got too high a couple years back. So I have a wonderful friend who lets me rent a room, the room that I have right here. So I'm blessed. We have heat and I'm blessed that she lets me live here for cheap. And I'm so blessed. So... I didn't feel it was right for me to like do yoga and be all out there. So I felt, I prayed and I've been meditating all day in the snow and I've been connecting and grounding and I thought, and then I'm not going to lie to you. And I got some wine. I thought, you know what? I've always just been so like straight when I talk yoga and right now, you know, we're all stressing out and we're all not working and it's ice outside and something happened tonight that the reason why I have the wine is because um, I have a neighbor, I'll, I'll just tell the store. A neighbor outside saw me outside chilling and she needed a ride to the store. So of course, you know, I drive in the snow. I gave her a ride to the grocery store and she got grocery for her kids. And I got me a few things because I was gonna fast today because I didn't have any food. So I thought I'm just gonna fast, what the hell. So I went on and went to the store with her and, and when we were checking out, it blew my mind. Now this woman is single mom, has two kids. She works now doing great, but she was homeless at one time. Now she's doing great, she's kicking it. So when we went to go check out, she grabbed a bottle of wine and because I wasn't going to buy it because, you know, I'm on a budget and everything. And she went on and paid for everything. She paid for her groceries and she paid for my groceries. And I was like, no, no. And she did that. And it made me realize times are hard. Things are crazy. People are in ups and downs. We have Congress and we have COVID. But and we have compassion. And I was so blessed that this random act of kindness given to me, I was so appreciative. So when I got the wine, I thought, you know, I'm going to have a couple glasses of wine and I'm not going to do a full yoga class because I don't feel correct to doing that right now. But so I want to do something and I can do it chilling. I only had a couple sips, so I'm not drunk or nothing. It kind of made me feel relaxed. So if you're sitting in your bed or if you're sitting in a chair and you just, you know, if, you're, if you don't have electricity, you just get your blanket, put your blanket around you, whatever you got to do. Ah, and just come together. Just sit down. If you're on the bed, cross your legs. If you can keep your legs straight, if you're sitting in a chair, whatever position is comfortable, just come to a position. All right? We're only going to go for about 10 minute-ish. You know, I just flow with it when I do these AJ Namaste live classes. So I just go. So whatever you're doing, just get your blanket. I'm even going to act like I'm in the zone, even though I have air conditioning. And we're going to start out with yoga breath, okay? It's called pranayama breath. I'm going to do a little teaching just to keep it fun for the people that are watching all over the world. Pranayama breath. You breathe out of your nose. You relax all the muscles in your face. I want you to relax your shoulders. The reason why I'm going to do a neck vertebrae stretch yoga flow tonight, because I know you guys are feeling it, and I'm feeling it. Everything hurts in the neck, in the back nerve rays, in our throat, the throat chakras. So for sitting in your bed, Hopefully everybody's together now. Cross your legs or your legs are straight. Relax all your phalanges, which are the fingers. Mmm, relax your chest. I'm gonna do cross legs. I'm put my right leg on top of my, under my left leg. I'm gonna have my palms and sit back so you guys can see me. Here we go, there we go. I got my ocean waves. By the way, everybody needs one of these. Ah. A sound box. This would change your life. I have ocean waves. Since it's ice outside, I want ocean waves in my mind. So there's my ocean waves. There's all different sounds. Back to where I'm at. All right. I'm going to probably go in and out of closing my eyes. But right now, cross your legs. Straighten your backs. Let's slow our minds down. And if you're in a dark room, if you got candlelight in a fireplace, enjoy that as your background noise. Mm, and just breathe. We're all just feeling energy and 
we're feeling things that are happening in the world right now and we're trying to catch up and be present and not get scared but just just enjoy this next few minutes just embracing your heartbeat and going to that heart place inside your mind and and then I want you to take it from your mind and take it down to your heart. Relax your shoulders. If you're sitting on your sitting bone, keep that back nice and straight. And if you're kind of laying down in your bed, that's cool too. Just get comfortable. Relax your feet if you're sitting in a chair. Relax your knees. Shoulders are lightly dropped and your chin's lifted. Relax all the muscles in your face. And just be right here. And don't forget you're made of love. And we're gonna get through this together as humans, collectively as bodies and energy and spirits. And, and we're gonna tell you a little secret as we're staying here and breathing together. You're breathing pranayama breaths, which is breathing through your nose and let your tummy expand. And when you exhale, you let your tummy come in. Mm, just like that. Just breathe and let your tummy expand. Exhale and let your tummy come in. And slowly let your head go right ear to the right shoulder. Take that left hand over to the side. And let's take that right hand and take it up nice and slow and just place it lightly on your ear. And just let that whole right shoulder and feel that stretch going all down your neck. And as we're breathing and as we're learning and growing and accepting our lives right now. Know that Mother Nature is in control. Come off nice and slow and just chill. And then drop your chin in front. And relax the shoulders. And I want you to give me three slow neck rolls. You're just going to roll your head slowly around your shoulders. Nice and slow. Three times. And just fill all the vertebrae in your neck. You're going to do that three times one way. And then slowly take it back three times the other. Nice and slow. Beautiful. Slowly come back up to neutral. Then we're going to take the head over the other direction. Take your head to the left let your left hand let that right arm go straight hold this and breathe mm, nice deep inhales and exhales so that stretch going all the way down your neck and just hold this and breathe slowly release inhale up release it down and then i want you to give me some shoulder rolls just if you got your doggies sitting around you, like my beautiful friend Mary, and you have all your puppies and your cats, just love on your animals and just roll your shoulders around and just feel that energy lifting through the shoulders, up and back. Oh, yes. And you know what I just realized, folks? <clears throat> this has just became an adult show because I don't think I put a jogger bra on. So that was a plan, guys. Hopefully I'm not showing nothing. And just roll the shoulders. Now we're changing directions. We're rolling backwards. Now we're rolling forward. Nice and big. Full circles around. Yes. And then I want you to wiggle your arms like a snake. Oh, yes. Then you're going to inhale up. Exhale down. Ah. Inhale up. Exhale down. Just feel the shoulders down. There you go. Drop your head to the left. And then I want you to bend the, excuse me, to the right. And let your whole body kind of fall. If you're sitting in a bed, just if you're somebody sitting next to you, you all just lean to the right. Ah, then let the arm, if that person's arm's here, just let the arm come and reach. You're in your bed, you're stretching your hips and your waist. Hold this and breathe. Look down at the shoulder. Mmm, and breathe. There you go, babies. And then look up under the arm, under the armpit. It is what it is. Look under that armpit. There you go. Ah, uh, inhale up, and then exhale down. Ah, uh, there's my girlfriend in Thailand on Namaste. Inhale up, exhale down. Now we're going to change sides. Oh, yes. 
inhale that arm up and you're just sitting in your chair or you're laying in your bed sitting in your bed stretching look down look down at the left shoulder stretching this whole rib cage lifting it i miss you Anne. i can't wait to come to thailand to see you i love you mama buddha rocks inhale up Ooh, exhale down oh my goodness this feels so good namaste inhale up prayer hands exhale white inhale up prayer hands down there you go sugars now just hold this and breathe and if you're drinking wine or drinking hot chocolate or hot cocoa it's time to have a drink there's my girl teresa teresa i love you live you are amazing i love all your life keep going teresa you love yourself and you're teaching the world how to teach women how to love themselves we gotta do a show together Drink some wine. Namaste. Back to prayer hands. Take it wide. Now take this right arm, left arm. We're going to do cactus arms if you're sitting in bed. Cross those arms in front. Twist them. There we go. And I let the shoulders relax. Now this is stretching all by in the back of the traps and down the shoulders. And just let your arms fall in front just like that. There you go, babies. Right there. Oh. Just feel that beautiful stretching down the biceps and triceps and the shoulders. There's my girl Rita. I love you, Rita. See you in Wichita. Mm, inhale, exhale. Inhale the arms in. Release them slowly. Palm it back. Relax the shoulders. Come back up to cactus arms. There you go. Same thing on the other side. Let the left arm come on top. Twist it all the way. There you go. Relax the shoulders. And then let the arms fall in front. This should feel good going all down the, ooh, the back of the deltoids and all down the back of the shoulders and all your posterior muscles. Yes. Feel this and breathe, sweeties. Beautiful. Inhale up. Exhale. Take it back. Palm it back. Ooh, yes. Do the snake arms. Back to the snake arms. And for guys, you can do rotator cuffs. There you go, man. Do some rotator cuffs. Yes. Let's do some chest press right here in front. Ooh, beautiful. Now we're going to take the arms to the side. Now if your legs are crossed or if you're straight, just straighten them out. If you're laying in the bed, just straighten the legs. Oh, yes, yeah, straighten the legs. Wiggle the toes. I'm going to move back a little bit. Wiggle the toes. Can you lift your body up off the bed? Lift your body up. Ooh, bend your knees. There you go. Come back down. Ah, inhale up. Prayer hands down. Take it behind your back. Lift your body up. Just lift your body up. It's good. Ooh, we're doing like a little modified reverse plank. Come back down. Take your legs to the sides. Oh, yes. We're going to a nice wide hip inner thigh strip. Stretch. Grab the toes. Pull the knees down. Drop your head side to side. Oh, look at that. There we go. Now we're going to plant your feet in front of you. Or if you're in the bed, just on the bed. Just do windshield wipers. Take them to the left. We're just getting the body kind of moving and grooving. It's been cold. It's been different. We haven't been working out. My gym's been closed for like three or four days. I'm dying now. Change sides. Take the row. hips and stretching all through the rotator. Hip flexors. Oh, yes, that feels good. Nice deep inhale, exhale. Beautiful, sweeties. Come back front. Yes, now I'm just going to take your hands. I want you to palm it, palm. Put your hands in front. Take the shoulders and just roll the palms down. That's stretching all the wrists. Let's take the neck, circle the neck around, just getting all the tendons and fascia, ligaments in the neck. Three times one way, and then take the arms back up to prayer hands, and then take the neck around the other direction. Three times, nice and slow. There you go, sweeties, just like that. Mm, excellent. Take those arms here, let's just plant them, go back to a nice sitting position. And just catch our breath here. And we're going to do that beginning stretch all over again. Just nice neck stretch, but we're going to do it a little deeper. You're going to take this left arm a little farther and let this right hand come up all the way, grabbing that ear and just let that whole shoulder just inhale, exhale, and just feel a nice deep stretch. One more time in the nice neck that we keep so much tension and so much anxiety and pressure and tightness. Inhale up. Exhale down. Let's do that one more time on the other side. Other arm is straight. Stretching all down the neck. 
and this just wasn't a long flow. This was just a nice, random, I miss going live in LXO. I miss just being in class. And I'm just going to end with just an ending meditation. So just come back to your comfortable position with your animals or not. Grab another swig of your wine or coffee or tea, whatever. Mm. Oh my goodness. Let's just forget about all the worries in the world and just realize that life is what you make it. It's going to get better. The weather's going to change. Mother Nature comes in and forces us to be still and to be present and be thankful. Count your blessings. Forgive your haters. Oh, I love you. Thank you, Mary. My girlfriend, Mary. Friends are my family. And I just want you guys to always remember that it's important that we just be careful and be mindful. Wear your mask and just get the world and America and wherever you live, your own personal countries. Let's be the change you want the world to be. Let's hug a hater. Hug a racist. Um, I have a friend in Switzerland, and he says something to me. This could be my little ending little story, because I feel like this has turned from a yoga show to a yoga talk to me just being live and raw and authentic. But he says something to me. He says, if half the world loves Trump in America, and the other half is opposite Trump, he says, so if everyone is full of love, not saying all Democrats are love, so he said, if everyone has love, friend a racist, and we'll all be friends. I was like, you're in Switzerland. That's what you were safe from your country. But other than that, what I'm really trying to say is, it's not going to take a week. It's not going to take a year. But at least we're going in the right direction. We as humans, we as brothers and sisters, we can um, make a better place for the next generation, which is what I fight for. You know my grandkids, Stella, Sebastian, and Ivy. So let's just be mindful and present and thankful and have gratitude and compassion and love a stranger. I'm gonna end on that note. I'm gonna ring my chimes. We're gonna come here and let's all breathe together. I'm gonna slow down. Let's all breathe. Three nice, deep inhales and exhales. Pramayama breaths. Relax all the muscles in your face. Relax your shoulders. Love your animals around you and your children and your family. Love is the only way the world's gonna get better. But you gotta love yourself first. God has angels and deities and protectors all around you. You're not alone. Mm, and just know how much I honor you. I honor that place inside you where all your truth dwells. I honor your place of friendship and family and animals and good health and unity and diversity. Black Lives Matter. And when you're in that place in you, I'm in that place in me. And we are one. Peace out, everybody. I know I'm kind of crazy. This is kind of random. But all I have is love to give. I'm going to throw this over on AJ Namaste on YouTube. So you can see it on YouTube. Have a good life. Do good things. And never give up. And always remember, if you don't love yourself, how in the hell can you love somebody else? RuPaul. Peace out.